Hello YouTube. Here's a, uh, a video on uh, the sick bed. Uh, I'm going to be showing you how to take the rear wheel off. A couple of tips so you can uh, check the uh, tightness of your sprocket bolt and go ahead and clean them. Get them dry. Use some Loctite on them. Put them back together. Torque it back. Now on this one I've done a modification. I'm not completely done with it. But uh, I'm drilling a hole through the flat part of the frame here. Right here. Which will enable me. I'm not completely through. My battery went dead. But. Once I'm through, I'll paint that so it doesn't rust. This is a steel frame, by the way. And I'll be able to go in there and check my sprocket bolts. If I find one loose, I take this wheel off and address these bolts. I've had a lot of guys uh, not listen to my advice, go out and ride their bikes and uh, have these bolts come loose and it's a catastrophic failure uh, for me i got 500 miles before mine came loose but this new batch of bikes it seems like uh first couple of rides first week they're coming loose anyway this is what we're going to do see am i yeah i am First thing is pull the caliper. Just get it out of the way. Five millimeter out. Just makes it easier to put the wheel in and out. Just pull this caliper on off of there. Get it out of the way. Next thing, stick a 13 sixteenths. Oh, first thing is to prop your bike bike up. I've got mine on jack stands. It's solid. It won't tip over. You've got to prop it up. And uh, loosen these bolts. Just slightly loosen your axle bolts on both sides. Then take a 10 millimeter. And loosen up these adjust chain adjuster bolts. Now before I did any of this, I measured the distance between the nut and the head of the bolt. And it was 14 millimeters on one side, 14.2 on the other. That can help you get it readjusted. I also made a mark almost dead center of the axle. Because I like the way my chain's adjusted. It's perfect. Okay. Loosen up these chain adjusters. Okay. Next thing is go ahead and take these axle bolts or nuts on and off. Look at that. Now I'm hoping when I slide this forward, I've got enough room to uh, get my chain off without having to take the master wrench. We'll see.
Okay. Now I'm gonna run these bolts back. These chain adjuster bolts. Give them a little bit of slack. This one's loose. This one's tight. Let's wiggle that a little bit. And let's move this turkey. There it is. Okay. All right, now let's see if we can uh, move this wheel forward enough to drop this chain. The uh, it's close, but not quite a cigar. Let me know it. There it is. All right. Next step is just take your wheel off. Your chain up on it. All right, slide your wheel on out. There it is. Okay, you'll definitely want to. Uh, Check these bolts. Should be a five millimeter, maybe a six. Oh, looky here, these are even smaller than a five. These look like a uh, 4.5. Maybe they're American. Maybe they're SAE. Let's see what this one does. This one's a little bit loose, but I think the next size up is too big. But anyway, let's see. Yeah, these things are rock solid tight. Since I've uh, blue lock tight on them. They're tight. Now the key is with Loctite is you've got to clean the threads on the bolt. Use alcohol. Use gasoline if you have to. Use acetone. Use anything solvent to knock the grease off. Let them dry. Then use a liberal liberal amount of blue Loctite. Put it back together. Torque it in a cross pattern. Let it sit for 24 hours. You can put the bike back together. Just don't ride it. And you should. You should have no problems. Now once I get this hole drilled. I should be able to put a uh, Allen wrench through there and check it. And if I find one loose, real loose, I'll pull that wheel and I'll address this issue. It's really simple, guys. None of this is real rocket science. Okay. Now to put the wheel back on, it's pretty much the reverse. Get it centered, 
pull it back to your marks, make sure you change tension, make sure it's centered, snug it up, use your uh, chain adjusters to uh, pull it in tight, and you're good to go. Okay, I will talk to you later. I hope this helps.